This is Dynaking's ultimate indexer fly tying vise. It's easy to use, extremely versatile, and built to last a lifetime. Perhaps most importantly, it's capable of holding hooks from size 8 aught all the way down to a size 22, absolutely tight in its jaws. The ultimate indexer is a true rotary vise. With a few simple adjustments, the rotary function can be used with just about any style or size of hook. Here's how the vise works. A cam handle closes the jaws when raised to the up position and opens them when lowered. A small detent in the cam clicks smartly into place when the jaws are closed. The vise is able to hold such a wide range of hooks because of various size grooves in the jaws. The widest groove toward the back is best for very large hooks. The next, smaller groove holds medium-sized hooks. While the serrated section of the jaw tips works best for holding the smallest of hooks. With the cam handle lowered, the forcing cone can be turned counterclockwise to reduce tension on the hook or clockwise to increase it. This is what it looks like up close. Counterclockwise reduces tension. Clockwise increases tension. It's very important to lower the cam handle before making any forcing cone adjustments. It's also important not to over tighten the forcing cone as this may cause the jaws to lock when the cam handle is raised. The bearing housing is what gives the vise its fluid rotary motion, but it can be locked down so the vise won't rotate. To unlock, simply loosen the rotary lock screw and the vise turns freely. Tightening the screw locks it into place. The ease with which the vise rotates can also be adjusted. This is accomplished by either loosening or tightening the friction screw on the back side of the vise. There is also an indexing knob, which when tightened allows the vise to be rotated to eight different indexing positions. This is extremely useful for a number of tying applications including curing epoxy. Loosening the knob allows the vise to once again rotate freely without stops. The vise body is also completely adjustable and can be rotated, raised, and lowered, which is critical for accurate rotary performance. To prepare the vise for rotary tying, snap on the supplied centering gauge. Raise or lower the vise body to bring the shank of the hook into alignment with the gauge. Once this is done, remove the gauge and loosen the rotary lock screw. The bobbin hanger can be swung into position to support the thread when you begin a rotary tying procedure. The unique bobbin mount allows the bobbin hanger to be moved into nearly any position imaginable. The materials clip helps to keep tying materials from flopping around and out of the way. This is particularly useful during rotary tying. An innovative angle adjustment shaft allows the vise to be positioned either up or down to maximize your tying and viewing options as well as comfort. The Ultimate Indexer is available with a large clamp with an outrigger or with a pedestal base shown here. Loosening the base lock screw allows the vise to come apart or to be raised and lowered. Shallow detents in the base are perfect for holding small items such as hooks and beads. 
And that's the ultimate indexer from Dynaking, manufacturers of the world's finest handcrafted fly tying vices and accessories.